Uh, so we'll read BD's card in a second. First, I have to go to the Pokemon Center. Oh yeah, I also upgraded my bike all the way because I was out in the nature zone. So my bike is as fast as it can be. <laughs> so don't you worry your little heads about that. Right, uh, lead cards, rare ones, starting with BD. Or I guess. <laughs> oh, that picture. Alright, we guess we'll start with Opal. Opal uh, has thrust the duties of gym leader into BD, who had his gym challenger status revoked. That being said, she still shows up at the gym stadium every day, giving unsocialized advice. Or no, unsolidicated advice. Coming up with new quiz questions and practicing various performances. What is this pink she's insisted others show her? Maybe a clue lies in the comment she made during an old interview. Keep thinking about the right answer, and eventually you'll create the right answer. Huh. That's kind of true. He was appointed uh, by the former gym leader, Opal, to become the new gym leader of Ballon uh, Lee Stadium. The general consensus is that Opal's harsh training has in fact mailed him out, although he himself has never confirmed or denied this. It should be noted that he no longer refuses to give autographs. Additionally, it seems his skills as Pokemon trainer have also increased rather dramatically. Recently, his intrusion during the finals of the Cup, uh, Champion Cup has gained popularity, and fans wish to see if that kind of performance once again. BD himself is not sure how to react. This signature change? Yeah, it did. It's very curly here. But if you go up to here, it's very squarish. But hers is exactly the same. All right. He started a brand new life for himself. A brand new BD. All right, time map. Off we go to the magical land of winter. <laughs> so my understanding is that if you play Pokemon Shield instead, the fighting girl becomes a ghost boy and becomes a ghost type gym, and the rock type gym here becomes an ice type gym, which honestly makes a lot more sense. Speaking of types, um, were you the guy? No. I got can lemonade. Uh. Oh no. You're a Draco Meteor teacher. I was trying to think if the uh, guy who teaches the ultimate basic moves for the starters was around. Because I want to see if I could teach Charizard Blast Burn. Oh, but I can do it later. Get to safety, you three! Who do you think you're talking to, then? We're here to help, not be helped. Oh, actually, I didn't realize who I was talking to. Right, he's here so everyone can relax! I was just thinking over how to handle all the Dynamax Pokémon, but with all you here, we can each take one of them on! Let's hurry up to the pitch. Right. I don't think Charizard's gonna survive if he tries to take on a rock type. It's kind of his arch nemesis. Yeah, this isn't gonna go well. <laughs> uh, I recommend switching to Vaporeon and then having Vaporeon handle this. Uh, Vaporeon, if you'd be so kind. Max Rockfall. Yow. Stay. Well, might as well try, I guess. That geyser.
Ha, huh, only half. At least it's not sandstorming anymore. Unfortunately, this means that Vaporeon's drop probably gonna go down. Yep. Oh well, it's fine. I still got Wulu. Wulu, you're my backup. Actually, no. Toto Rage, you're my backup. You hit harder than Wulu does. I'll point out my regular Iron Head did more damage than a super high power water blast. Well, that's fine. Whatever. Nice work, everyone. No one's hurt, are they? Ha! Ha! Oh, he's not laughing. Ha! Just barely. Battling a Dynamax Pokemon all on your own is pretty hard work. <laughs> I expect nothing less from you, Raggy. You seem like quite the reliable trainer, too, Hop. I I do. Looks like he ain't used to compliments. Look, he's got a grin wider than Meowth. Galar Meowths have seriously wide grins. I do not. Shut your gob, Piers. I'll take care of the Pokemon we battled, so there's no need for any of you to worry. All right? Raiky, it's hardly a reward for what you've done for me, but please take a copy of my league card. <coughs> If anything comes up, please contact me. All right, I wish you all the best of luck for the future. Looks like most of the stadiums have got this Dynamax problem sorted now. Let's keep up the pace, Raiky. There's only one Pokemon Stadium with Dynamax trouble left. Let's finish this already. All right, I have a question. Uh, firstly, I want to check that lead card. Gordy, what the heck? Oh, that's what it looks like when his hair's down. All right. Gordy is one of the top trainers of the Galar region, both in terms of popularity and skill. His strict training style means that his gym is few gym trainers, but he does have quite the fan base. Gordy does his best to make sure his fans are happy, often seen giving out autographs or hosting events. There are currently three photo albums of Gordy, all published throughout the support of his fan base. This card shows another special photo taken specifically for this purpose at a photo studio. All right. Man's famous. Da, 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 da. All right. Um. Hmm. After I heal, let's actually take a stop at Spike Mouth because I want to see if there's another special event. Because A. Piers is no longer the gym trainer there, right? And B, Piers is constantly worried about his sister, and C, we did have that little event in the hotel. So I'm wondering if there's something special if I go over to Spike Mouth right now. <coughs> in we go. Let's see here. There's a lot of left, or a lot of right in this direction. Nope, there's nobody here. Yes, I will do that. I know I have one, because I have a stupid number of Pokemon. Wait, where is he? I know I have one. There he is. There. I'll trade my Obstagoon for your Mr. Mime. Oh, you have a regular Mr. Mime. It's not the, uh... It's not the one from Galar. Wait, is this the guy who was stopping me back when I first came here to train? Or when I first came here for the gym challenge? Oh, whatever. 
All right, out we go. Let's not hit posts. Alrighty, here we are. Hi. Oh, Raiki! Someone saw the sword and shield weirdos. They said they got through the door. But the door's closed with an electric lock. Opening it might take some time. Ah, so that's where I'm going next. Makes sense. Nice timing, you lot. The stadium's just about reached its limits. There's simply too many Dynamax Pokemon running wild in there. Seems wishing star power has been using, uh, is being used for some evil purpose. So that's what caused all this? That's a problem, all right. Before we get that sorted, we got to do something about these Dynamax Pokemon. Glad we got you all here now, though we've already done the bulk of the work. We would help out too, right, Rocky? Uh, leave it to us. Fantastic! Looks like we got ourselves together an unbeatable team. Especially you, Piers. The way you battled me in the Champion Cup. You really had my Dynamax Pokemon up against the wall. Things might actually go better this time if we split up our little band. Right, everyone split up so we can each take down one Dynamax Pokemon. Let's do it! I like Piers, but I like the dragon guy, too. Actually, there's a lot of characters here I like from the... Oh, hi. I want to catch you. I mean, I don't know if I can, but I want to. All right. Let's see. Haxorus. Let's do it. Max Wormrind. Here we go. <laughs> this is a guy I can actually fight with Charizard. My Charizard's fast, he hits like a truck, but he's kind of squishy. Alright, let's see how this goes. So he uses Max Worm Wind. Doesn't do much to me because I'm not a Dragon type. It did exactly half my health. Aw, oh, man. Right, now I use Max Worm Rind. And it's super effective. There we go. Uh, there's a minor issue that I am slower than he is. But I've lowered his attack, so maybe that'll make up the difference. Yeah, because he's going to use it again. If it's special attack, then there's nothing I can do. Charger's going down. Nope, we're good. Alright, let's see if this is enough to finish him off. Otherwise, I'll have to switch out Pokemon. There we go. And down he falls. You guys are the greatest. You really got me in a tough spot there. I think I better snap a quick one to remember this victory by. I'll take care of the Pokemon that went wild. No need for you all to worry about that. Raiki, give me a ring if things should go pot again. I got Raihan's rare lead card. I'm always happy to lend a hand if I can. The great Raihan is here for you anytime. And Piers, you and I have got to battle again. This time, no Dynamaxing for either of us. Wishing stars being used for evil. I assume you all are already looking into who's behind it, right? Carry on then. I'll take care of things here at the Hammerlock Stadium. Right, I think that's all the stadium is sorted now. We didn't miss any, did we, Racky? All that's left is to catch the sword and shield weirdos. If we don't find them quick, they could just start up all this again. Wasn't Professor Sonya supposed to be looking into where those two weirdos might be? And once we find them again, I'm gonna take them right down. 
It's a rodent phone, Raggy. It's got to be Sonya. I mean, she could just shout to you from across the room. She's right over there. But no. You know, we got technology and all, so let's have her call you. Dang millennials. Raggy, it's me, Sonya. Eh, called it. These sword and sheared wheelers got into Hammerlock Stadium and are headed for the energy plant. The door to the plant's locked, but I think you can get it open. Give me a bit, and you'll be able to get in there. You hear that? Hammerlock Stadium! Get over there! Oh, still her. Get over there as soon as you can! Even over the phone, Sonia still sounds lively. We're already at Hammerlock Stadium. The door of the energy plant should be right down the hall. Guess we should get going. Uh, bag. Do I have a hyper potion? I may not have any potions. I have a lemonade. Good enough. Yep. That's as good as I got. Alright, moving on. Maybe I'll switch out Charizard to not be in the front. Because Charizard's had a few rough patches recently. Uh, Vaporeon, you can be in front instead. You're a heavy hitter. Hey, I was right down the hall from you. What? You're back already? Hold on a moment. I think I've almost got it. Huh? That's strange. That works. What? It opened? Hamper! I should have known. Thanks for your help. Those two weird guys are probably up ahead. Be careful. Well, I guess I'm on my way. Oh, but wait, now that I think about it, the first Pokemon those guys send out is always a Steel type. So I might as well have Charizard in the front after all. Hello? Weird guys, I've come to apprehend you. <coughs> well, well, well. Hi, who are all these people? It seems as you have broken the lock and rescued the stadiums from their perils. As expected of the champion. You, followers, give them your praise. What's with these weirdos? They really creep me out. Why are you forcing Pokemon to Dynamax? All the lies and fake stories you all believe. We did it in order to expose the true nature of Zakan and Zamazenta. Zakan and Zamazenta saved all of Galar. Pa! What a fool! We have always been revered as the rip, uh, resplendent descendants of the real hero. It's all because you ruffians had to go and save Galar from Eternatus, and that woman went and wrote a whole book about it all. That's right, that's right! You should be ashamed! I'm so confused. What is happening? You said that the real heroes were Pokemon. You just carelessly- I didn't read the last part. What does that mean we are? You dare say our esteemed ancestors were liars? Uh... I get it. So basically, he's saying that the Pokemon were the heroes the whole time, and the humans didn't do anything, and that's what Sonya's book was about. Because we had our butts saved by the Sword and Shield Pokemon, even though we fought along beside them, they weren't ours. So technically, the Sword and Shield Pokemons were the ones who came and saved the day, because even Leon, the undefeated champion, couldn't defeat Eternatus because he couldn't Dynamax. And so he's saying that because we wrote about that, we've essentially blemished the history because he believes himself to be one of the true descendants of the, of the former kings. Well, I could believe that you are to our uh, descendants of a Galarian king. That's right. Compare the way things were to the way they are now. It's obvious that the old history was better. It was right. To suddenly start creating heroes left and right is complete rubbish. Ah, he wants prestige. Because now me and Hop have taken over the role of heroes and he wants it to stay in his family's legacy. You're wrong! What I wrote was the truth! My hypothesis was that Zakan and Zamazenta have been protecting the Galar region since ancient times. Well then, if we are, if we are at an impasse, perhaps we should test which truth is the most trusty. If things are really as you say, then even if we bombard them with Galar particles, they should remain calm and stalwart. I get it. So all those sudden Dynamax Pokemon from before were just your little experiments. You seriously want to make the two Pokemon that saved us all run amok? Hmm. It seems you're indeed capable of understanding something. 
My adorable younger brother is wrapping up the preparations above. You think we'll let you get away with this? Oh ho, so you want to take the lift up? Then you have to defeat us! <laughs> I can't really battle, but I'll support you however I can. Leave the small fries to us. You tackled the blue guy, Raiki. We've got to get up, uh, up top quick, Rocky. I'm counting on you. Take down the ringleader. I can't talk to the others. All right, bring it on. This time, I shall show you the opulent Pokemon I've raised explicitly for this battle. Challenged by Pokemon's trainer, Swordward. You know, I'm starting to think I should have rolled with shield. Just because I think I like the shield legendary more. I just didn't like that it had a shield as a weapon. But when it doesn't have the shield on it, it looks like a knight. And plus... Even shield hair is better than the floppy thing I'm fighting right now. <laughs> Alright, Sir Fresh, bring it on. Use an air slash on you. Down he goes. There we go. Now Charizard's proven his worth. Get me those wins, get me those points, not dying in one hit. I don't need to. I'm a fire type. And I'll use flamethrower. Because I have charcoal, so this is really going to hurt. Down you go. Next. Pikachu leveled up. 68. Yes, we do have to switch for Golisopod. If I remember, this guy is a poison water? Or is he like a uh, water something? Yeah, water bug. That's right. Oh, yeah. I also got Electro Whip. So use first impression. Ooh, you got paralyzed. Nice. So your speed fell. And you're paralyzed. And then I'll use Thunderbolt. Which does more damage. Ah, oh, wasn't enough. But it's fine. He's emergency exit. That could be bad. All right, Pikachu, you gotta tough it out. All right, we'll use Electro Whip to slow him down, so that when the next Pokemon fights him, he won't have a problem. Sacred Sword. We'll finish off Pikachu. And then Charizard will come in and save the day. <coughs> Flamethrower. You're faster by a lot. And he was slowed. So it all works out. Nice. Doesn't matter. I understand you want to get it over with and lose, but why don't we enjoy this a little longer? Lose? Buddy, your guy's paralyzed. He's not going anywhere. One air slash is going to end this. Or he'll miss. But it's okay, he's paralyzed. Alright, I guess Dragon Breath has a better chance of hitting. Plus it looks cool. That's it. Oh ho, my noble Pokemon. Look at that hair wilt. And so I am defeated. We've driven them back. Now we can head up to the roof. Oh, we got Pokemon howling. What was that sound? Ah, well, it appears that my younger brother was given enough time. Should we head up? You're just gonna leave this guy, or? I guess so. <laughs> I've always wondered, is there anything over here now that uh, Zalazenta's gone? Like, is there something in the egg? Secrets, treasures, maybe? No? Okay. Alrighty, moving on then. Let's go get Zakan or whatever his name was. 
Oh, I did it! I did it, older brother! It looks like it came following after the rusted shield. See, that one's way cooler. It's got, it's like a knight. A night wolf. I bombarded it with Galar particles! Stop! Zamazenta's in pain! This is all because I let them get away with stealing the rusted shield! Yes! Expose your true barbaric, brutish nature! And reveal to us exactly who the false kings are! Yeep! Uh, younger brother! Don't attack me! Go into town and sow as much destruction as you can! It's trying to suppress and calm itself, but it can't control all the power. Zamazenta! I was hoping we could just calm it down like we did with the others, but our opponent is a legendary Pokemon. If you're thinking about catching it, think again. I hate to admit it, but if anyone can stop it, it's gotta be you, Raiki! I'll keep everyone else safe down here, so you don't have to worry about a thing. I can catch the shield? You just focus on calming down Zamazenta. It's coming, Raiki! I'm so confused. I thought I got the sword one for playing Pokemon Sword. Alright, so if I throw a Master Ball at it, do I waste the Master Ball? I better test this with a Quick Ball. Dauntless Shield. Like, can I get both? Because I want both. You can't throw a Pokeball. Damn it! I really want this guy. Like, I want both. Alright. I guess I'll have to trade him at some point, somehow. Alright, so Zamazenta... That's nothing much. He apparently doesn't have any moves that work really well against uh, flying types. He's very fast, though. And then Pokemon will switch out for... Oh, uh, how about Noivern? I wish I could catch him. Whatever. Whatever, we'll make it work. All right, so he crunches, barely does the thing. Noivern's a higher level than this guy. We'll just boom burst and be over with it. Oh wow, he's faster than my Noivern? Noivern's speed is like its highest stat. All right. Well, this ends it. Dang, that guy was tough. Zamazenta, are you all right? All right, seems fine. Hop, watch out! Ah, the other one came to stop it. Hey, fairy dog. Zakane. Woof. Thanks for saving me, Zakane. Looks like it still can't control all that power. I don't like this, Raiki. Not for one bit. I'm going after Zamazenta. I come too. And this belongs to Zamazenta, not you! Uh. Hop took back the rusted shield. And we have a pissed off fairy puppy. But please don't hurt my younger brother. Uh, Zakane. Look into my eyes. What do you see? Zakane stares into your eyes. He does. He sees. He sees nothing but black. And he's out of here. He's not dealing with me. I got crazy eyes. As expected of the champion, you took completely control of a situation. Plus, it looks like that Pokemon's waiting for you. Oh. Oh! So this is how I catch him. My younger brother isn't harmed. For that, you have my gratitude. So, such a fearsome creature. And we thought we could control it as we pleased? Truly, we have been foolish fools. 
It seems we have lost. We apologize for any trouble we caused. Amazing. Absolutely incredible, Raiki. I wonder if Zakane is thanking you is thanking you too. Eh, he says the same thing. Uh, I might as well master ball this guy. Right? There's no reason to make this a long fight. Zakane gives you a calm look. Ready, uh, ready the rusted sword to catch the cane? Yes. Well, actually, no. Hold off on that. The cane appeared. I'm just thinking, is there a need for me to catch this guy? With, uh... The cane has an intense look in its eyes. Actually, no, I have to use a Master Ball because I forgot to save before fighting him. So if he faints, he's, it's going to put me back a far away. So Master Ball it is. Use the Master Ball. Whatever. There's no Pokemon I can't catch, really. That's it. A little anticlimactic, I know, but, like, what was the alternative? If he died on me, which he may very well have... I would have been in deep shit. <laughs> Alright, we got Zakane. Uh, known as a legendary hero, this Pokemon absorbs metal particles, transforming them into a weapon it uses for battle. Uh, I can add to my party. Let's see. Vaporeon. We'll switch out for you, buddy. Or Charizard. Hmm... I already have a flying type that knows dragon type moves. So really, Charizard's only benefit is they know fire type moves, but I don't really need it. So Charizard, you're going away. Uh, put him in my bag. All right, so I have Zakane in my party now. Wow, brilliant. Seems you've been recognized by real royalty. Ah. Uh, what a sublime battle. We were so preoccupied with fussing over who the new king was. How terribly uncouth-like. Hey you, spiky head. Ugh, why should I go expecting those two would start learning some manners now? My older brother and I will atone for our crimes. Please escort us to the appropriate place. If you really want to atone, what's with that posh superior attitude? Ah, whatever. Raki, I think I understand why you became champion. But please, don't go calling me anymore. Seems like I'm only getting called out when you're in some sticky situation. <laughs> He's the one guy who doesn't want me calling him. Professor Sonia, I can't ask you to forgive me, but I'm truly sorry for deceiving you. I was really hurt at first, but I've, r I've rallied. Thanks to you, I end up learning quite a bit. Uh, that came out a bit more sarcastic than I thought it would. <laughs> well, please continue to do your best as a professor. Alright, so those three are going to jail, I guess. right -o, we stopped them from causing any harm. Still, I hope Zamazenta's okay. Raiki, your rotom phone. Probably hop, I reckon. Hello, Raiki? I was just... Whoa, hey, calm down! <laughs> I suppose you heard that. Yeah, I got Zamazenta here with me. Are you okay? Samazenta started going crazy, so things have been better, but I'm hanging in there. I can sure use your help, though. Get over here quick as you can, would you? I'll be waiting for you in the heart of the slumbering world. So I can get both of them? Huh? Huh? He sure sounds like he's got his hands full. Guess some things never change. Even in its Pokeballs, the cane seems worried about its partner. We should go to the slumbering world and see how Hop and Samazenta are doing. Alright, so to cl let's clarify a few things. Number one. Uh, Pokemon. Zamazenta. Check summary. Uh, Held Adam Rusted Sword. So if it holds the Rusted Sword, it transforms. Boosts its attack spat when it enters a battle. And no Sacred Sword, which hits like a truck. Ooh. So. Oh, the target stat changes don't affect its attack damage. So if the enemy uses like a defense curl, it's going to hit the same. I didn't know that. Sword Stance, of course. Iron Head, of course. Crunch. Okay. Alright. Pretty nice setup. 
Uh, all right. In that case, Zamazenta, I guess I'll keep you in front. And I guess we're going to go capture the other one? Or Hop's going to catch it, more likely than not, and I'm going to have to get the other game or do a trade in order to get the other guy. Which sucks, but if it has to be, it has to be. I mean, I say the other one's better, but ultimately I want both. Oh, yeah. League card. Ah, uh, Piers, my boy. What? Oh, that's a rare card indeed. It's Piers without makeup when he first started. Here are some words from Piers when he first became the gym leader of Spike Mouth. Huh. That's when he first became gym leader. Uh, the name's Piers. It's too bad we can't Dynamax our Pokemon in Spike Mouth, but you could say we have a more authentic style of Pokemon battles. And I plan on showing that off. And well... I have a younger sister, and she's got way more talent than me. But until she's old enough to become gym leader, I'll keep rocking with my crew and make sure Spike Mouth stays lively. Aw, oh, Piers, you're my hero! What a cool guy. I take it back what I said about Raihan. Piers is the best. He's the best gym leader. All right. Uh, hey, Mom. Looks like you and your sweet Zakane may be running on empty. Let's have you rest up. Your sweet, sweet legendary Pokemon that you brought home. Totally normal. Professor Magnolia mentioned something unbelievable the other day. She said that Dynamaxing doesn't actually make the Pokemon itself grow bigger. But they're still able to physically interact with others, right? They must really hold an amazing amount of power. Anyway. Alright, so my Pokemon are all healed. We're gonna go meet with Hop. And we're going to flip and save. I... Uh, yeah, not yet. I want to save the game, so if I, this is does become a capture mission, I don't have to worry about losing uh, Zamazenta in the progress, or in the process. Let's go to the center of the forest. Oh, I guess he's already been caught. All right. Hey, Hop. Easy there. Everything's going to be all right. You don't have to lose control. You can manage this. I know you can. You're the true hero who protected the Galar region, after all. Bark. Oh, got everything under control? See, I knew you could do it, champ. Hop, you look a fright. You two made it. And yeah, well, I was just focused on trying to calm down Zamazenta, so. <sighs> Rushing in and trying to calm a legendary hero head on was awful reckless. Uh, looks happy now. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? Though I can tell you, things were looking pretty dire here at first. W what Really? You sure about this? What did Zemazenta say? It thinks I'm worthy of it. That it'll become my Pokemon. Damn it! Called it! I'm pretty sure that's what it was anyway. Wait, seriously? That's totally crazy! Uh, I just caught one not five minutes ago. Is it... Is it really okay? I mean, I had a battle mine first. You have a master ball on you? Here I go then. And he caught it with a regular Pokeball on the first try! Damn it, Hop! <laughs> That's just salt on the wounds, man. That is just salt on the wounds. You wanna trade? Hop, do you want to trade? And honestly. You two really are something. I still don't quite see anything like that in myself yet. But thanks to your help, I'm starting to. Raikki, I've got a favor to ask. Though I hate to look like I'm copying that posh jerk beady, still, I want another battle against you. Everything started right here. In the slumbering world. Bring it on, my boy. I don't think he's going to have Zamazenta as his first choice. Because obviously we want to do a legendary off. So Wulu will be in front. Because I know that first, his first Pokemon is probably going to be the sheep. Hop sure must, have been, uh, must be tough if he's been accepted by Zamazenta. Make sure you're in top form before challenging him. Uh, no, I do not need to go back to the woods. Alright, bring it on. 
This will be a proper battle, Raiki. You sure you're ready for me? All right, let's go, Raiki. Challenge by Hop. There, see, I told you to start with a sheep. All right. Let's do it, Raiki. Don't hold anything back. Okay, let's see here. Are you going to comment when I do a super effective move on you again? Like you always do? All right, double kick. And he rose his defense. Of course he did. All right, I'm probably going to get hit first, so let's do reversal. Yep. I can call it. Nice. He did not comment on me using a super effective move. I guess he's used to it now. Having seen it 12 times. All right, so a rule is down. It's just hard to beat a legendary of your own, or a uh, evolve form of your own type. Actually, yeah, I could use the con. I have a fighting type now, might as well. All right, so he has the rusted sword, so he has upgraded powers, right? Uh, Sacred Sword, why not? There we go. Double down. Also, are all Hop's Pokemon, like, level 70-ish? Because if so, how the blazes would I have done this without a buttload of items? Uh, my goal was always to surpass Lee, but he's not the champion anymore. I'm not sure what my goal is now. Yeah, uh, what was I saying? I forgot. It's fine. It's fine. All right, there's two down. So sick, I forgot what I was saying. I'm out of tea. I'll have to go get more. Uh, Ryla Bloom. Yes, I am going to switch for Noivern. Because Noivern's a champ. Oh, yeah, I remember what I was saying before. Guys. You and Sonya followed your own paths. I was the only one left behind and trying to catch up. What a complainer. No, uh, what I was thinking was, I forgot again. There's gonna be a lot back and, boy, I love being sick. There's gonna be a lot back and forth with that. Oh yeah, I remember again. This time I'm not gonna be interrupted. Basically, um, basically with all those guys at level 70, I had to do a lot of grinding in order to get these guys up to like level 68, 70 like they are now. And that's just because I was trying to catch Pokemon like crazy. But back then, my Pokemon were only around like level 63. How would I have challenged Hop back then without using like a buttload of items like I did with Leon? I don't know. Whatever. Uh, that's the electric one. We'll use Toto Rage. Ah, oh, well. But then I went around saving Pokemon alongside you and Pews, and I realized I could help other people. Way to go, Hop. You're following your dreams. I'm following my dreams, too. But my dreams are taking a bit longer to achieve than I want. I'm working on it. And that's what matters, right? All right, Perchin is not down, interestingly. That move is awesome, by the way. Uh, I guess I'll use pay... Yeah, payback. Aw, oh, Hop. He's just dragging this out now. All right, now he's dig. And I'll take advantage of that to blow my nose in the middle. Supposed to be like the ultimate battle at the end of the game. I mean, I guess so because the legendaries are involved, but 
I was just wondering what happened to his brother. Because I have not seen his brother since I beat him at the championships. I think there's quite a few characters we haven't seen since the championships. Blast, you really got me with that one. But battling sure is fun, Raiki. All right, 69. I don't think I can one-shot him. So let's try Electroweb. <laughs> there we go. Wow, critical hit? That ability does not do much damage. But then again, it's not supposed to. It's just supposed to slow him down. This is the ability that does damage. Wow, he's got good special defense, eh? Uh, attack row sharply. And I'm confused. Alright. This could go any which way now. Confused. And pulls through. There we go. Tour Rage 69. Hop is about to send out Zamazenta. Yes! This is the ultimate battle. My understanding is that uh, Zama, or the one I have, Zakane, is actually stronger than Zamazenta because he's part fairy type, whereas the other one's only part fighting type. I want to see which one of us comes out the victor. I couldn't finish that line. It's kind of a strange feeling, Raki. You fell too, don't you? <laughs> not really. Yeah. I knew you must. It's kind of embarrassing, but I'm glad it's not just me. All right then, laugh or cry all you want, but this is the end. And I speak very quickly. All right, it's Dauntless Shield. Intrepid Sword. It's a legendary face-off. I'm gonna use Swords Dance. Yeah, because uh, he's a fighting in steel and I'm a fairy in steel, but I can use fighting type moves, I have an advantage. Also, apparently you're faster than me. Even though you're the shield, supposedly. Whatever. And then we'll use Sacred Sword and end this in one, this in one blow. Yeah, so if I had Zamazenta, I'd just get rid of his shield so he'd stay in the knight form. Because the knight form looks kick-ass. All right, he's down. Down once and for all. Zakane, got XP's. Thanks to you and Lee, I'll keep on getting stronger. I know it. Ah, just a spirit. That's our greatest champion for you. You really are strong, Raiki. But getting beat this time felt a bit different. I may have lost, but I feel great. You know what, Raiki? I think I found a dream of my own. I want to become someone that can help out Pokemon that are in trouble, wherever they are. I think I want to become a Pokemon professor. Oh. I didn't see that one coming. You don't stri strike me as the studious type pop. I started thinking I might, uh... I might when we were going around all the stadiums to help Pokemon that were running out of control. I know I don't know enough about Pokemon yet. I've got no experience for this sort of thing. That's an understatement. But I'm going to study and learn a whole lot. And someday, I'll become the sort of professor that you, Raiki, and you, Sonia, well, the sort you'd be proud to know. I'm going to take a different path than you and Lee are taking, Raiki, but I'll still always think of you as my true rival. Uh, yeah, either way, they're nice things to say. Same here. We'll always be rivals, you and me. Ah, no fair! You two are uh, so young and cute. I'm tearing up. Sonya, getting a bit weepy in your old age, eh? What? I'm still young and super energetic. Say, Hop, fancy becoming my assistant at the lab? What? I've got all the books and data on Pokemon you could ever want. I need to remember to get that high pitch in. Since you want to be a professor someday, I'll oversee your studies. Then I definitely want to. Only, you sure I really can be any help to you? Of course. Mind you, it'll be a lot of work. Work's really been piling up since I lost my first assistant. Wait, so what you really mean is you're offering me the position to help yourself out. Ah, fine. I'll still do a bang-up job. 
They'll be back too, right, Ryaki? I got Hop's Rare League card. Clap, clap, clap. Aren't you guys in prison? Oh, there's Leon. Well, well, well now, that certainly was a splendid battle and a refreshing back and forth. Eh, what? He actually did the eh, what? Well, 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 that really touched my heart. Huh? Sword Art and Shelbert? With Piers? And even Lee? What are you lot doing here? No need for the noise makery, young lady. We have come to meet with the young Master Raiki. I didn't get the chance to properly apologize yet. And all we gotta keep an eye on them. It did technically descend from the original Kings of Galar, after all. Seems you lot have been all up to all sorts of things while I was stuck in Rose Tower trying to take care of the mess the chairman left behind. Oh, what? He's the new chairman? He's the new leader of the company? The guy who runs the Pokemon League? You have no idea. Those two are forcing Pokemon to Dynamax all over the place. And for that, we are truly, really, truly sorry. Look at our sorriness. We thought only of ourselves and brought harm to innocent Pokemon. We've truly caused a large amount of trouble. Master Ryaki, you helped us even though we did those awful things. We are so worthy, or you are so worthy of the throne. You could say it's a Dynamax sized amount of worthiness. I already told you to. Zakane and Zamazenta are the real royalty. Incorrect! We have abdicated the title to him. There are no other rulers but Raiki. I'm a king now? Hmm, now that I look closely, you absolutely do have the air of a celebrity. Ha 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 ha. Well, fancy that. You think, I think you've grown on them, Raiki. Oh dear. Reluctantly, I'm afraid we too must away. Our tour to apologize to those we've troubled awaits. All right, this is a step up. I've not only become Pokemon League champion, I've also become king of the Galar region. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Well then, goodbye. <laughs> Oi, don't go running off on your own. Hop. Eh, uh, what? Just so you know, I saw your Pokemon battle against champion Rocky. You sure have gotten strong. It was so good, I nearly sent out my Charizard without thinking. Wanted to join in on the fun. It seems like you found your own path to walk in life, Hop. As your older brother, and as your rival, you have my full support. I... I do? Strike a pose. Oh? Leon gave you some pretty high praise. You look like the Meowth's got your tongue, Hop. Ah, oh, zip it, Sonia. I do not. <laughs> Alright, I guess we should get going, too. Right, then it's a race to who gets back home first. Is this the true ending? Is the game over? No more? Yeah, that's it. That's the end. Ladies and gentlemen, we've done it. We've beat Pokemon Sword. Oh, man, what an experience that was. All right, so this is always the... Uh, the awkward part of the show where I have to figure out a good ending to sign us off on. Uh, let's see here. Before I, yeah, before I get to that, let's find a good place. Location, location, location. We're gonna finish this off right. Be right back. Okay, this place seems as good as any to wrap things up. So, ladies and gentlemen, Pokemon Sword was amazing fun. I really enjoyed making this uh, series with you guys. Um, Pokemon Sword, the game itself, is the most fun. I've had in a Pokemon game in many, many years, so I highly recommend to get it if you don't have it already and you're thinking that you want to get back into the swing of Pokemon. It definitely lives up to the quality of X and Y, which in my opinion is still the best one. Still the best Pokemon. But yeah, I had a great time. The story was awesome. I love the sports theme, which I've said a million times, and I'm not disappointed at all. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for staying with us for this long, long series. We're done! We did it! We finished! I'm doing mini poses here in the middle of the street to show off my doneness. If you like the videos I make, hit the like button and subscribe. And I'll see you all in the next series, whatever it may be! Bye!